ready and uh, set to go for a battle between them. the visiting walleye and the hometown bombers. What are you looking forward to here tonight, James, on 90s night? Looking forward to a throwback playlist. It's going to be fantastic. And on the ice, I'm looking for just a hard-hitting, fast-paced game here. Yeah, old old time hockey, heavy lumber, elbows up, sticks are just kidding there. Uh, Rock can't and get away with that em. anymore. Exactly. Back to the good old days. Don Cherry, Rock and Sockum, five and six. Hopefully we'll see a little bit of that here tonight as we get set to go. Big face off. An orthodox pass by Riffle works out as it finds its way back to Palmer, sends that down low. Riffle chops up that, changes direction. Center chance. Finds its way home as I think that might have been Owen Riffle, James. Yeah, you got your wish there and uh, sorted half the crowd here anyways with that beautiful little power play goal by Owen Riffle. And he's going to add to his total. Good start there by the Supergoat Bombers. Owen Riffle is 28th of the year. Oh, beautiful shot there by Bell as he Finds a way to get that in, and that's, that was a goal, fellas. Hate to say it, that was a perfectly placed shot right up under the bar. Yeah, back Bryden. bar and out. Bryden Bell ties this thing at once. Here comes Connor Burke, joined by Blake Burke. Center chance, oh, wow. Great save by Sadoskis, he's feeling that. One blank save is Connor Burke. That twin brother Blake, great right in the slot. One chance, or one timer chance, made no mistake. And Sinoskis stayed equal to the task and slid across James and kept this game tied at once. Face off to the right of Sinoskis is in control. Controlled by the Bombers. Green takes that shot. Oh, great tip there by Owen Cotter. Finds its way past goaltender Sadoskis. Just like that, the Bombers have restored their two to one lead. Oh. Visiting Cam River, fighting Walleye. That was a gorgeous tip by Cotter. Perfect positioning, beat the goaltender. I think Sadaskas thought he had that. Here's Dunmore, backhand chance. Great job there by Osmond. Stand tall. Did a little acrobatic to make sure he was able to cover that one up, James. Yeah, I wasn't quite sure. There was some bodies rolling around back there, but freeze the puck for a face off. 18 seconds left in the period. I think the Bombers are just trying to take the momentum into the locker room here. So Ryland's going to join us here for the for a little color commentary. James will be jumping on the sticks. Yeah, you didn't know you were getting into this, did you? Nope. You thought you were coming up here to play some video games, and next thing you know, you're right in the mix. Yeah, I thought I was going to just be running the camera, just like on NHL, but uh, looks like I'll just be joining you. Perfect. Well, I uh, try to keep each other in line here. So I have to ask, uh, Rylan, what is the story behind the Mountain Dew? Give us, uh, can you can you t can you share that? Is that? Uh... Uh, it all started from one of the players uh, last year. He brought it to the team, and uh, he just really liked Mountain Dew, and I think the coaches liked that, so they kind of awarded the guys after uh, after their games they win. So kind of get a little treat and get rehydrated with some good Mountain Dew. You don't want to be uh, too reliant on your goaltender. You want them to be there when you need them, but uh, like I said there, you want to make sure you're getting in those lanes, getting those sticks in the passing lanes, the bodies in the shooting lanes, and make life difficult for those walleye. Oh, oh I thought he had it there, but just as we were saying there, shot from the slot, finds its way through Osmond. Power play goal for the walleye. It's going to tie this one up at two. Back on the walleye. Back to the point for Debray. 
Oh, oh beautiful shot there. It's going to be up over the shoulder. Osmond. Cam River fighting walleye. James have found themselves with a 3 to 2 lead here at 7. 33 left in this third period. Yeah, a rolling puck there. Hard to read for the goaltender and just up and over the shoulder. The Russ Tyler knuckle puck here on 90s night. There's seven seconds left here, so plenty of time for the Bombers to get something drawn up. And good job there by the wallet. Win that face off. Riffle. Back for Bullet, takes that shot. Ooh, centering chance. Can't quite find the target. Potter, last chance. That's not going to find its way home. Sadowska stands tall for the walleye here. Cam River after a big third period. Find that go ahead goal. They're going to pull within one point of the Sulukout Bombers for first place in the league overall.